Okay, hello everybody. Welcome to the Rossler's Biometric Solution Session. My name is Giora. I'm a pre-sale engineer at Rossler Security Products and thank you for joining us on this presentation. But before we start with the presentation itself and dive into the details, I would like to share with you a few facts about Rossler. Rossler is a global leader in the access control domain. Rossler brings 40 years of experience in the security area and delivers advanced solutions across the globe. Rossler owns multinational in-house R&D teams, product design and manufacturing capabilities. We develop, manufacture and sell products to all major markets, supporting our partners to deliver products of any complexity and size, from a single entry access point to multinational cooperation with most demanding requirements. I will present to you today in this session, the Rossler's Biometric Solutions. We can see here the Rossler's bio Biometric Portfolio. These are great products for those who need a biometric solution. And in this presentation, I will run you through all this product portfolio. And first, we will talk we will talk about Rossler's 9000 Biometric Series, a series that provides professional grade biometric fingerprint and facial recognition capabilities. The 9000 Biometric Terminals are based on highly speed optical sensors with 500 dpi dots per inch using sophisticated algorithms for encryption and liveness check to verify that it is a real live finger that is presented to the optical sensor. This series supports BLE, turning the mobile into a soft credential, taking advantage of the convenience and flexibility of mobility. And keep in mind that the BLE technology can be used not only for the implementation of soft credentials, but also for management and reader setup alongside with the Axox NG software. Dual or multi-factor authentication. As we have quite a number of identification possibilities here, using different kinds of credentials like fingerprint, card, face, and pin, it is possible to combine the different credentials and implement dual factor authentication or multi-factor authentication, meaning the user, the car holder, will need to use two or more separate credentials in order to grant access, resulting in enhanced security. And in terms of design, this product family is innovative with modern design and engineering achieving a best-in-class solution. Okay, so let's move on now and get, get into some more details about the 9000 biometric series, some more technical highlights. So in terms of capacity, we have the fingerprint terminals, which are the AYB 9120, the 9150 and the 9250 that holds 20,000 fingerprint templates and 10,000 users, while the face recognition terminal, the AYB 9350, holds 50,000 fingerprints, 100,000 users, and 2,000 face templates. In all the terminals, the authentication is done instantly. The database scan is very rapid. It is less than one second, and it is also verified that a real finger is presented to the optical sensor using liveness check technology. Two weekend output formats are supported, 26 bits and 30, 34 bits. And all these terminals can also work as a standalone controller and control a local door with a built-in relay. These biometric terminals can be managed by the Axox NG or by the Rossler Bio 9000 client server software. They support BLE communication using mobile apps for identification and reader management. That means that we have apps available with these readers for the AYB 9120, the 9150, and the 9250. And these are Bluetooth apps for utilizing the mobile as a soft credential using BLE AD app. And there is another app, the BLE Admin app. The one that you would need to configure the readers is the BLE Admin app. It is a management tool, an administration tool, installed on the mobile device and enables the administrator to configure the reader, making deployment and management 
quick and easy. It is IP65 rated for water and dust re resistance for the AYB 9120, 9150, and uh, 9250. And there is an audible buzzer to indicate things like access denied or access granted. One or more beeps may be used for different indications, and this can be customized. And there is an optical wall tamper detection. If someone is trying to rip the reader off the wall, we will get an alert in the Axox NG system. And here we can see how they look. The first one you see on the left is the fingerprint reader, the AYB9120 for the 125 kHz EM card. And on the right, you see the 9150 for the 13.56 megahertz MIFO smart card. They look the same, but differ by the RFID reader. As they work both with both fingerprint and RFID card, you can implement dual factor authentication with them for enhanced security. And remember, as we say, they also support our Bluetooth apps. And here we see the 9250. It supports fingerprint, our Bluetooth app and RFID card, the 13.56 megahertz smart card. And you can also tie it in with a camera to grab a snapshot of whoever is swiping his card. Now here you can see uh, the LCD screen, you see with the cursor that I'm pointing at, the four, the four function buttons, the sensor, and the RFID, uh, the RFID reader. Um, and what really, what are the major parameters that we can, uh, we can see uh, on the terminal display here? We can see the time, which is synchronized with the Axox NG server. We see, we can see the user ID and the function keys. And we can configure the four buttons for time and attendance, for an example, if we operate at a standalone mode. And as we said, the built-in camera is for the access event snapshot. And then there is our 9350, which is our facial recognition terminal. So it's got four levels of authentication, face, fingerprint, the RFID card, and PIN. The camera that you see uh, right down here, surrounded by uh, the LED bar here, are actually on the gimbal. So it will automatically aim up and down as someone approaches to be able to get a great shot of his face. Uh, the infrared LEDs are for low light environment. So if it is dark, the LEDs will lit on so you can identify the face though it is dark. And regarding physical installation, you give yourself the best chance for success with clear picture with any type of video you want to create by mounting it in an area with some good lighting that, you know, uh, for example, you don't have a flickering fluorescent lights being in the background as you don't want the figures to look like in, in a horror movie. You want to have some good clean lighting for a good picture. So this is a facial recognition device with up to 10,000 face templates on the standalone mode and 2,000 face templates on the Axox NG mode. Again, we use two moving cameras for this face recognition. The cameras are motorized and when you stand in front of the device, the cameras go up and down to have a good look at your face. It is a dual frequency RFID card reader that supports both Prox 125 kHz EM cards and 13.56 megahertz smart cards. And we have here a five inch touch screen used also for configuration and settings. And as we said about this family, multi-factor authentication is supported, face, fingerprint, card, and pin. And there is also the fingerprint liveness check. With Rossless 9000 Biometric Series, your mobile is your new credential. The 9000 Biometric Series supports mobile apps as soft credentials and as management tools. We are actually talking about BLE technology that applies for both soft credentials and management tools. I will present you now 
the Rustler smartphone apps. These apps will allow you to turn your smartphone into a virtual credential, a soft credential, and actually make your, your mobile your, your new credential. In fact, we are talking about two main applications. The first one is the BLE ID used to identify the user. And the second app is the BLE admin used for configuration and reader management. It enables the administrator to configure the reader and do all the key settings. These apps are local installation on your mobile device. No internet is needed since the apps resides only on the smartphone device and works in the background. It can be installed on a wide range of mobile devices currently on the market. Mobile devices that have the Bluetooth functionality, the Bluetooth technology. Each credential is unique to the device. So when you install it, the app, it utilizes the MAC address of your phone and creates a virtual credential based on that information. It is a touch-free operation, which is really important nowadays with the COVID-19, and it is used also for remote enrollment. The range on that is about 39 feet, so something like that. It is about 12 meters. It is an easy operation. You just open the app and choose the specific reader you need, and you're good to go. Fast and easy adoption in, organi in, in organizations seeking to use mobile capabilities, it improves efficiency and productivity, making it very easy to deploy and manage the readers. The biometric readers that support the BLE technology are the AYB 9120, the 9150, and the 9250. And here you can see our USB desktop reader, our fingerprint scanner for the Bio 9000 series, or actually the desktop fingerprint enrollment device. Using this device with Axox NG or with Rossler's Bio 9000 software allows easy fingerprint enrollment to your access control system as you are onboarding employees in your organization. The DRB 9000 is equipped with innovative fingerprint identification modules to acquire high resolution images with most advanced optical sensor that has scratch proof glass scanning surface. It has window support and it is USB 2 compliant uh, and USB powered. Now we're gonna talk about Rossler's 8000 biometric series. The 8000 biometric series comes in two flavors. The first one is indoor biometric terminals, which is the AYB85 family. And the second flavor is outdoor anti-vandal anti -vandal biometric terminals, with, uh, which is the AYB86 family. Each reader can enroll up to 7,000 fingerprint templates. This is the capacity. It means it has a built-in memory that can store up to 7,000 fingerprint templates and by using its high-speed CPU, it can scan a one to 7,000 7, list in less than one second. This solution is ideal for any business from one door and up to thousands of doors with up to 7,000 users per reader or up to uh, 3,500 users per reader if we use two fingers per user. Each template is assigned a biometric user ID by the controller. When a fingerprint is read and the biometric features are verified as valid, the ID is sent in a Wigan 26-bit format to the controller. The reader does not process the access rights as this is done on the host controller. It has a scratch-resistant glass surface that does not wear out, that does not wear out with heavy use, what contributes to a long product lifetime. Fingerprint data is encrypted in storage. This is Rossler's proprietary encryption. The fingerprint cannot be recovered from the stored information. This way we protect privacy and increase security. Each biometric reader enables dual factor authentication, fingerprint and card for enhanced security. And we see that the readers can, can be set up easily and configured using the Axbox NG client software by TCP IP connection. And alternatively, uh, Rustler's standalone client server bio 8000 management software can also do the job. And it's also perfect for interfacing with existing third party system. 
And there is also built-in buzzer and LED indication to indicate diff different statuses. And here we can see our two terminals of the Away B85 family, which are the indoor installation biometric units. Uh, at the left, you can see the Away B8520 that support 125 kilohertz EM cars. And in the right, you can see the Away B8550 that supports 13.56 megahertz MIFR smart cards. Externally, they look the same, but internally the, they differ by the RFID reader, 125 kHz or 13.56 MHz. The rest is the same. The AYB86 family is IP65 rated with epoxy porting for water and dust protection, capable of reading both wet and dry fingers. It features a rugged metal case, IK10 rated, making it anti-vandal anti biometric unit for outdoor installations. Also here, as in the former slide, they look the same and just differ by the RFID reader. The AWB 8620 uh, supports 125 kilohertz EM cards and the AWB 8650 supports the 13.56 megahertz MIFA smart cards. The DRB8000 is uh, the USB fingerprint enrollment scanner and, dos and desktop biometric reader to be used with the Rustler's 8000 series fingerprint biometric terminals. The device features a modern design with an advanced optical sensor and a glass scanning surface, crystal clear finger scan with high resolution images and a scratch resistant surface, making it robust and long lasting for heavy duty. This desktop enrollment reader can be set up using the Axwax NG client software or the Rossler Bio 8000 standalone management software, which also allows third party controller support. It is USB 2 compliant and USB powered. And it uses standard drivers, so it supports Windows operating systems from Windows XP to Windows 10, and therefore no driver, no driver installation is needed, just plug and play. And here we can see Rossler's Match on Card Biometric Series. In this slide, we are talking about the AYB1660 and the AYB2660. They have the same features and capabilities, but only differ by external design. The family of fingerprint biometric readers this, this family is based on match on card technology. In this technology, the fingerprint templates are not stored in the reader or in the controller, but on the tag or card that the user, the card holder, presents to the reader. The card is swiped in the reader. The reader reads the encrypted fingerprint template that is on the card and compares it to the finger that is physically presented on the biometric sensor and checks if they match. Uh, if there is a match, access can be granted. The, verif the verification is done instantly. No search in a fingerprint database is needed. So identification, decision, and reaction is very rapid. This way, not any private information is stored in the system. No stored space is, is captured by, by personal data. And thanks to that, users' privacy is maintained. Identity, identity, theft, and fraud are avoided and security in this way is increased. And it is also allows the number of users, the number of car holders to be unlimited. The reader support MIFA Classic EV1 smart cards and scan biometric data stored in different sectors on the MIFA Classic smart card. Configurable output formats. Output formats supported are Wigan 26 bits, 32, 34, and 40 bits. And it has optical tamper sensor for case and wall tamper detection. And as we said, if somebody tries to rip the reader off the wall or open the terminal case, an alert will be sent to the Axos NG system. And regarding technical and engineering design, it is small, elegant, 
accurate, rapid, and cost-effective terminals. Fingerprint enrollment, we will see that fingerprint enrollment, configuration cards, and user cards can be created by using a device, using the Rossler's CPR26 desktop smart card programmers and fingerprint enroller that we will talk about in the upcoming slides. The Rossler's AYC B7761 is a convertible biometric terminal that can work as a biometric reader or a standalone controller. It supports the Metron card technology like the AYB 1660 and the 2660, meaning it can scan biometric data on a MIFA Classic EV1 smart card and compare it with a presented finger on, it, on its biometric sensor. This is called the one-to-one -one technology that can support unlimited number of users. Once the card is verified, the AYC B7661 sends the car ID to a connected controller. If it works as a reader, or directly opens the lock strike when access is granted, if it works as a controller. But the big added value here is that the AYC B7661 supports not only the Metron car technology, but can also work with fingerprint templates stored in the memory of the unit, stored in the in the database, in the terminal's database, applying the one-to-many technology. In this technology, the sensor ver verifies between fingerprint data presented by physical finger and biometric templates stored in the database of the unit. Up to 107 fingerprint templates can be stored in the terminal, meaning up to 107 users are supported. And also here, output format supported are Wigan 26 bits, 32, 34, and 40 bits. And also here, it has optical tamper sensor for case and wall tamper detection. Again, if somebody tries to rip the reader off the wall or open the terminal case, an alert is sent to the Axox NG system. And now let's see how to create the personal car for the user, for the car holder, with his fingerprint template on it to be verified and matched at the Rossler's match on card biometric readers. For that, we have the CPR26 uh, device as where we mentioned before. Rossler's CPR26 is a sophisticated, highly secured universal desktop programmer unit for MIFA Classic EV1 card applications with sector reading capabilities. This lightweight, sleek designed desktop unit offers high flexible, easy to use card programming and fingerprint enrollment. The CPR26 is compatible with Rossler's smart match on card fingerprint reader family. The card to be programmed is placed on the CPR26 unit's card tray. The user's physical finger is put on the optical sensor of the unit, and the card is programmed with the user's fingerprint template using the ASB01 accompanied software. The CPR26 is controlled by Rossler's ASB01 card programming PC software connected via an, an, an encrypted link. Using CPR, 26 and its ASB01 software provides high quality MIFA Classic EV1 card read and write functionality, as well as master card creation for reader configuration of the fingerprint readers. And also we have a leads and a sounder that indicates current activity, if it is read, write, verify, if it is an error or success, as well as guiding the user in his fingerprint enrollment process. And also, uh, this device, the CPR26, has a great design. It is slim, lightweight, with small desktop footprint. And it has USB to computer connection, at, and it is identified automatically, so no drivers are needed. Well, that's it. Thank you for being with us. Here's my contact information, my email and my cell phone. If there's any question on what we have covered so far, you are more than welcome to contact me by mail or by, or by phone. So see you then, and I wish you a great day.